Okay guys, today on Chris Does What, we'll look at these Vaunt desk lamps. And uh, I have two of them for both of us to work, but not a bad lamp. I've, I've taken one out, I've, I've been testing it, things like that, and it seems to be really functional. And uh, it's going to do what I desire, provide light in the area I need it for my workspace. So y'all stay tuned and we'll unbox this one, show you what it comes with, and then we'll go over the features. first get this you'll see that it of course comes out of box it has a nice handle I guess you could use it as a carrying case if you want to you know move this around or you go from office to office I really don't know but uh, well packaged and then on the front of the box you'll see of course the Eclipse desk lamp and then you'll see reading mode study mode relax mode and sleep mode so it has different colors of light so it helps prevent eye strain things of that nature on the back you'll see that this is a, a abs uh, plastic and it's 11 to 14 watts so not much power here and uh, you could probably plug this into say if you're an RVer or a, a traveler get an adapter and plug this into your 12 volt accessory plugs now let's open the box and when you first open the box it's going to basically your lamp in the center here and then uh, little compartments for the accessories it comes with so we're going to take out the lamp. It's not that heavy. It's just ABS plastic, so that's good. You'll see it's well covered, so it doesn't. Uh, it protects the finish here because this is a black finish. And you'll see the LED lights right here. Your controls right here down at the base, and your power comes at the back. It's just a, a, a little plug. Then on the side it has a USB charger, so you can charge your phone or put that accessory on your desk. Take out that, and we're looking inside the box. It comes with your instruction manual, which it's a light. So you'll see right here, it says all your, your different modes. It lets you adjust the mode you're in. It has your power on off and a sleep function. So if you're reading at night, you can hit 60 minutes. And if you fall asleep reading that really boring book, it will turn off. It comes with a clean cloth. I have noticed that the base right here, which is pretty heavy, to keep it from moving it does get smudges so if you don't like smudges you may want to clean it the base is shiny it says Vaughn their logo and uh, it's not going anywhere if you're uh, setting this on your desk and you're moving it around this is fairly uh, uh, beefy right here. It's not going to move. Let's see how loud it was. You get your 12 volt power adapter. So you can plug it in the wall and then plug it in your device. Like I said, if uh, you're an RVer, you may be able to find this plug and splice into your 12 volt or a cigarette lighter 
So to put this together, you have a little screw thing on the bottom here. It just unscrews. And you pop this right in here. And you screw it back together. Like so. Be sure not to tighten it too tight. It will restrict the, the turning of this. So it won't turn as easily if it's too tight. And you, you, if you notice, I already got smudges on it right there. Then you plug in your 12 volts into the back. And there you go, a fully assembled light. I have the light turned to you so you can see the color and the brightness of the light. This one is on high now. Let's go ahead and turn this off so we don't get ambient light. All dark. And we'll turn this one on. It's just a, a touch for power. And that's pretty bright right there. This is reading mode. I turn this down and it's a less bright reading mode. Turn it max and it's really bright. And then we go to study mode. You see the color of the light changed to more of a bluish. And of course we can turn study mode down and up. Depend on how bright you actually want to study. And here is our coffee mode. So you have that morning coffee. You grab this up, you're not quite awake. There you go, it's kind of a, a yellowish and uh, nice bright. So I guess you can start in the morning. And then uh, when you're done starting, you hit that work mode and you're wide awake. And you go into sleep mode. Sleep mode is, is very dim, so I know you can't really see it here, but if you look at the light here, it's pretty dim. And so you can uh, use this, say if you have this in your room next to your, uh, your bed, you can set it up and uh, not hopefully wake up the person next to you or disturb them too much. And then you can go full bright on sleep mode or full dim on sleep mode. Full dim on sleep mode, let's turn off some of these studio lights, is not going to be that bright. So, and then you're going to go here and touch. You can see the difference. So this is a uh, reading mode, this is study mode, coffee mode, and sleep mode. So, sleep mode is definitely the dimmest of all of them. So, it also has a, a USB charger port on the side. So, this is great for in the office or wherever you're working or this light set up. Because I can see here and I can put my phone on it. I have a fast charger right here plugged into it. And there we go. It's charging. My phone's fully charged, but if it wasn't, this would be you know, nice to have at my desk. So, there it be. So if you like this and you're looking for one, I've left a link down below. And uh, I got one for both me and Danielle. So we can both work at the same time. A lot of fun. If you like this channel, please subscribe. You know, it's down there. There's also a bell to get reminders from. If you like this video, hit that like button. It's a thumbs up. It's also down there. If you're looking for great eats and good recipes, check out our blog at chrisdoeswhat.com or go straight to the yummy goodness at diningandwithdanielle.com. They both go to the same spot. Just dining in with Danielle takes you straight to the recipes and probably what you're looking for. I also do write reviews and DIYs and things like that, so you can check them out too if your heart desires. And uh, leave comments, feedback. If you have this lamp and you like it, leave that down below. 
If uh, you have questions about it, leave that down below. And y'all please take care.